With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Our question is liquids A and B form an ideal solution in the entire composition range. At 350 Kelvin, the vapor pressure of pure A and pure B are 7 into 10 raised power 3 Pascal, 12 into 10 raised power 3 Pascal respectively. The composition of vapor in equilibrium with the solution containing 40 mole percent of A at this temperature is. The pure vapor pressure of gas A and gas B are given to us. Using Dalton's law of partial pressure, here using Dalton's law of partial pressure and relationship between partial pressure and mole fraction we can calculate the number of moles of in vapor phase so here formula use the formula is used here y a equal to p a upon p t where y a is the mole fraction of a in vapor phase p a is the partial pressure of a p t is the total pressure of mixture now p a equal to p naught a into xa we here p naught a is pure vapor pressure of liquid a and xa is the mole fraction of a pt equal to pa plus pb and mole fraction equal to mole percentage divided by 100 so here we can see that let us see the question now here we are given mole percent is 40 mole percent of a now mole percent equal to mole percent of a is 40 percent then mole fraction of a equal to 40 by 100 which is equal to 0 0.4 and a fraction is always calculated from one or the sum of the fraction of all components in a mixture is always one hence we have mole fraction of b is 1 minus x a which is equal to 1 minus 0 0.4 which is equal to 0 0.6 here now we will calculate the partial pressure of a using the formula we have given pure vapor pressure of a that is let us see pure vapor pressure of a is 7 into 10 raised power 3 and pure vapor pressure of b is 12 into 10 raised power 3 now p a equal to pure vapor pressure of a into mole fraction which is 7 into 10 raised power 3 into 0 0.4 on solving this it is equal to 2.8 into 10 raised power 3 here here 2.8 now p b equal to 12 into 10 raised power 3 into 0 0.6 on solving this it is equal to 7.2 into 10 raised power 3 calculate the number of now using the formula we will now finally calculate the number of moles of a in vapor pressure state okay as we see that the formula is y a equal to p a upon p t which is total pressure p a is 2.8 into 10 raised power 3 and p t is 2.8 into 10 raised to power 3 plus 7.2 into 10 raised to power 3. On solving this y a equal to 0 0.28 mole fraction of a and mole fraction of a plus mole fraction of b equal to 1 we know that. So y b equal to 1 minus 0 0.28 on solving this it is equal to 0 0.72. So the mole fraction of A is 0 0.28 and the mole fraction of B is 0 0.7. So from here we can say that option fourth is the correct answer of this question. XA equal to 0 0.28 and XB equal to 0 0.72. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.